What's up folks? Um, just wanted to give you guys an update on this uh, this build. This is a work in progress and uh, I did contact uh, Bulkman to see about the details as far as the tension, the pre-tension on the lead screws and the different updates that were provided in my kit but I didn't have the instructions for it. So they were able to provide me with two um, additional manuals that go with the um, with the manual that they sent and this has got the work B version 2 alterations and then the tingle tension system guide so now uh, now that I have these um, in this um, this tension system guide it uh, addresses one of the major things that I had pointed out that was in the original uh, set of directions about the groove on these plates. Now in in the depictions that I uh, had told you for the assembly I had specified about how there's the groove where the bearing sits into and that needing to be on the inside of almost all the plates that are on the system. With this new tension system guide they actually sh have showing that as being reversed so the the little uh, indent side facing outwards. Now I was also told that the way that I did show you guys will work just fine with the thrust bearings being on the outside and not in the pocketed groove. So the way that I did show you on the last episode, um, assembly part three, that will work just fine. And that will operate just fine. It won't, there won't be any mess ups that you have um, because of it being set up that way. So I just wanted to address this give that information out to you guys I'm gonna have these I'm gonna update all of the all of the uh, episodes up to this this far with uh, links for the directions both the one that I the original one and the two uh, additional ones that are updates for everything so if you wanted to look at those or if you have not put together your kit yet um, you can make those changes with the plates being opposite. All of these plates that are on all this entire machine are reversible. So they can go on the opposite end. So instead of the plate being on the right, it'll fit on the left with the indent facing out. So you'll still be good to go. If you wanted to take your machine apart and change it up like that, you can do that as well. But it's not completely necessary and it won't it won't uh, damage your system to leave it up the way that I showed you how to put it together. So I just wanted to get that out there um, just in case if anybody still hasn't put theirs together yet or if they wanted to make the update and then also provide the updated um, manuals to you and all the links and everything below. Um, if there's any questions that you have or any things that, that I can help you with or maybe visually um, showing you on my machine. I don't plan on taking mine apart and changing the plates around because I, I don't feel that I need to but if somebody needs the help uh, I'll be more than willing to, 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 to demonstrate it and to show somebody. So that was it. Quick down and dirty update. Thanks for uh, continuing to view the channel. Thanks for all the likes um, and thanks for the new subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, please do so we can make sure that you guys get these kind of updates like this. Because as much as I get the updates and as if there's any updates in the future, I will make sure that I will video those and demonstrate them as best as I can. Alright guys, thanks. Hope you have a good day and I'll see you next time.